It took great courage. Great courage. Great courage. Tragically, some of these children died while attending residential schools, and others never returned home, and died never having received a full apology from the government of Canada. The government of Canada now recognizes that it was wrong to forcibly remove children from their homes, and we apologize for having done this. Counts of the emotional, physical, and sexual abuse and neglect of helpless children, and we apologize for failing to protect you. Policy has had a lasting and damaging impact on Aboriginal culture, heritage, and language. You were powerless to protect your own children from suffering the same experience. On behalf of the Government of Canada and all Canadians, I stand before you in this chamber so vital, so central to our existence as a country, to apologize to Aboriginal peoples for the role the Government of Canada played in, Indian, in the Indian residential schools system. And we apologize. And we apologize. And we apologize. And we apologize. The Government of Canada sincerely apologizes and asks the forgiveness of the Aboriginal peoples of this country for failing them so profoundly. And for this, we are sorry. We are sorry. We are sorry. It is a testament to their resilience as individuals and to the strengths of their cultures. It also hurt all Canadians and impoverished the character of this nation. This Parliament chose to treat First Nations, Métis and Inuit people as not equally human. We are and always have been an indispensable part of the Canadian identity. Our peoples, our history, and our present being are the essence of Canada. Are the essence of Canada. Of Canada.